Hey, what's up, Mike? Welcome back, buddy. First one. I was at work. Last day, it turned out. Uh, hold on, I'll get in the counter. A small coffee. Alki, do you read me? Alki, come in. Damn it! Someone go out and find him. Check the dig site. How's it going, Tucker? Sure as hell, don't miss your shit. out. start, is it? Started out with no bullets or, or nothing. Death by wolf mauling for sure. I'm really low on bullets. I should have probably looked at that before I came to this mission. This is, I got my hands full here. See that guy right, right there? He's kind of the new breed, new type of zombie I've been coming across lately. And they're like 10 times the strength of the original or the regular zombie. I don't have enough to take him down right now.
I gotta find some stuff. I'd rather face five of those wolves than that guy right there. See if I can find some ammo or something. There's the horde up there, see him? Looks like they're all piling into that. Go take on that big guy. I think maybe this is not the place for me to be right now. <laughs> Is he fighting them? It looks like they are. Look at all those zombies are taking on that guy and he's taking it. He's taking the pounding. Well, one thing's for sure, they're both helping me out. Maybe a handful of the zombies die. Got him. Now. Now they're coming for me. Hey, what's up, Niels? Hey, what's up, Gary from the UK? How are you doing, sir? At the sawmill, going after him. Be careful, Deacon. Remember, there's there's a big fucking horde here. Yeah, I remember. Thanks, Deacon. Out. I 
got to get back to my bike and then come back a different time. All right, two dog. Where are you hiding? It's up over here in this little area. That was a good reference, Mike. I, I caught it. I wasn't ignoring you. I'm just trying to kind of think here for a second. I, I, that was a good reference, so I like that. That's how it kind of just felt for me, too, at the moment. This is probably part of their eating ground right here, or their feeding ground. Where's my bike? Right there. Here, can I? No, I'll probably die. Nothing really around for me to loot. Let me see if I can go over here to one of these towns. I need a whole bunch of everything. Scrap bullets. Yeah, I lost my bike. There's a horde back there. I can't get it right now. I have to go get some bullets. I'll try to go back and reclaim it. I didn't actually lose it. I know where it is. I just can't get to it at the moment.
crap, right? No. Frag grenade in a proximity mine. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I heard somebody talking. Hey, what's up, Felipe? Hey, how many drifters you guys murdered today, huh? Yeah, I can tell by looking at you. She's dead. 
She's dead! What? Don't mind if I do? We need this. Who's that? Bounty. Like I said, digs the subtlety of the music in the game, very atmospheric. True indeed. This game is a masterpiece, it really is. <laughs> Got it. Neil said, do I know who Marty Schottenheimer is? Yes, he was a uh, NFL coach for many years for the Kansas City Chiefs. I think he started out with the Cleveland Browns. He passed away today. He was a legend. He was around for a long time. I don't know how old he was, but he had to be close to 80 or if not in the 80s, I would think. Give me some scrap somewhere. He was 77. Was it uh, COVID related, did they say, or? Damn, I really don't have, I really don't have ammo for these guys. Alzheimer's. Last thing I wanted to do now was mess around with these. Felipe said he platinumed this game last year. 
in his opinion, it was one of the best PlayStation 4 games. I would have to agree with you on that. It's right up there with The Last of Us, I think. And that's what a lot of people compare this game to. And actually, it seems like people don't give this game enough credit because it came out after The Last of Us, but it's just as good, in my opinion. very generous with supplies I think it's because I kind of came through and, and looted this place out before but I know that the supplies do uh, respawn I just maybe I got them too soon I mean they give you some stuff just not the things I need you know I'm real I'm real heavy on uh, healing supplies I just I'm pretty low on scrapping ammunition And I know part of the game is grinding, you gotta do this kind of stuff, but I like getting out and just shooting and killing stuff. And I really miss my bike. I hate running around doing this kind of stuff. But Usually when that music changes, like that something's in the area a horde or a bear or those wolves something's in the area right now heavy melee weapon user and my melee weapon is at 17% which means probably three or four hits and it's it's a goner I think the horde is on the move See if I can avoid them. shoot them if they attack me that's gonna gonna alert the last hit. Now, I imagine those two zombie wolves or whatever they're called are going to be I just need to get my bike. <laughs> That's all I want to do is just get my bike.
At the sawmill. Going after him. Be careful, Deacon. Remember, there's. There's a big fucking horde here? Yeah, I remember. Thanks, Deacon out. Scrap. Now there's scrap in there. There wasn't scrap in there before. Alright, two dog. Where you it's my bike. That big guy's back. Wait, my bike is over here. Oh, what am I doing? There's my bike right here. I would say that was a waste of time, but it was a learning experience. I got in over my skis on that one. Let me see what else we can do here. We'll follow along on the, the Boozer storyline. Surviving isn't living. Mike said that's how I feel. Just give me my damn bike back. <laughs> yeah, right? Let's see if we can load up on ammunition and scrap weapons and all that stuff and we'll come back and try that later later on in this broadcast but just not right now said I think the guy you are in the game looks a lot like Ashton Kutcher I guess he kind of does yeah I can see that it's all right open it up Deke how oh my god Deacon I heard you were the one who got the lights back on oh, thank you so much yeah, well, you heard wrong. It was all Ricky. She's the one that you need to thank. Ricky? <laughs> I could kiss her. Just don't tell Bree. Oh, well, can I watch? Huh? Nothing wrong with that, right? Oops. Wrong one. New items. Yep. A drifter crossbow. Okay, then. So how does my, why does it say locked? They're locked. Oh, I can't use them in town apparently. Maybe that's what that means. Still need ammo though. Don't be such a stranger. Hey, hey, heard a rumor that you're looking for those black choppers, Nero. Is that true? I think I saw one the other night. Yeah, well, you heard wrong. I don't, I don't give a damn about Nero or their choppers or anything else. Well, sorry, man. Uh, why so testy about it? I mean, yeah. Yeah, see you, Deke. You here to buy something? Hey, Buzz. Looking for anything in particular? All right, I got you. <coughs> sure, all right. All right, let me save it real quick if I can. 
See you later, Deke. Good to see you, Deke. How's it going, Buzz? Addy. Hey, Deacon, how can I help you? Uh, it's Boozer. Is he okay? He's, yeah, not well. He's not. He's not sick or anything. It's just, I don't know. Well, I told you that it was going to be a big adjustment. Do you have any drugs around here? Like antidepressants, something like that? No. Sorry. Okay. Wait. I heard about what happened. How we went after those guys who were killing those dogs. Yeah, and he nearly got us killed while doing it. Well, maybe that's your answer. Yeah, he's a dog. Killed while doing it. Look, what does William love so much that he'd be willing to risk his own life? He doesn't need something to heal his body. He needs something to heal his soul. I got it. Maybe I can get him one of those big zombie wolves. Thanks, Eddie. So we'll see if we can find a dog. Oh, they kind of left it open. Hmm. So these two here, this bounty hunter and the world's end, are at the exact same place. One of them is the zombie horde, and one of them is a bounty that I have to collect on two dogs or whatever his name is. The actor who gives him his voice is in the movie Tales of Halloween. That's what somebody else was mentioning the other day. I haven't seen that movie yet. I do have it and I just have yet to watch it. The Officer Down and Officer Down. See if Ricky has something for us. One job available. Does that say one job available? Oh, job in progress. You here to buy something? How's it going, Buzz? Mike said, pretty realistic. If I'm living in this world, I'd be on the lookout for drugs, too. <laughs> Neil said, the clown from Slipknot directed. Ah. Corey. I can't think of his last name. I used to be a cop. From Slipknot. Believe it or not. Farewell. I think we had a pretty good Corey something. I think his name was Corey. What do we do here? We'll go to Copeland's camp and see if he's got something for us to do in the meantime. Mike said, I have Officer Down, but haven't seen it yet. Great cover art hooked me. I gotta check that out. Did any of you guys see that? Hey, Deacon, you there? Hold on a second. Yeah, Addy. Check this out. If one of my patients overheard us, they might know where you can find a healthy dog. Okay, I'm listening. There's a small resort south of Sherman's camp. Uh, a bunch of cabins in the woods. You know the one I mean? No. Okay, it's off Santium Highway. The same road you take to the old sawmill. I, uh, and Ricky said she rode with you over there to see the horde? Yeah. Day you guys were gone all day to the dam. Oh yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. I know, I know what you mean. Have any of you guys seen that newer movie with Vince Vaughn called Cell Block? I think it's Cell Block Ninety Nine. I heard that's really good. That's going to be one of my next views. Gotta check that out. 
Vince Vaughn is one big bastard. He's like 6'6 six, six in real life. Just a big... He could be a big monster if he wanted to, but he's always a comedian, you know? said yes that's a really cool movie you've seen it so I gotta check it out I heard really good things about it but it seems like it kind of went under the radar not too many people are talking about it but the ones that have seen it said they like it if someone's trapped you gotta help I don't want to waste bullets on that Neil said Vince Vaughn is awesome as a gangster in the HBO show True Detective Season 2. I have not seen 2 yet. Season 1 was phenomenal. I love that. With uh, McConaughey and Woody Harrelson. It was a really, really good show. And Mike said I have the 4K. Nice. Hey Mike, do you have a uh, YouTube channel? And if so... I gotta get subscribed to that. If not, why not? You should consider doing one. Here's a weapon. Put some nails on it. All right, we're back in business, boys. We got uh, starting to get a little stuff here. Mike said it's an RLJ release, if I remember correctly. And RLJ the, and Magnet, the same thing. They, they're not the same thing, but uh, they both are kind of under the radar companies, but they do put out some really cool stuff every once in a while. It's got to be around here somewhere. They're not one of the uh, fabulous, well known companies, but they always do put out really good stuff, I think. Come on, Pooch. Where are you? Guess there was just no hey, sneaking up on that. Mike said, yeah, under my name, I have a cool Criterion Collection vid you might like, definitely. Um, so it's it's under Mike Eli. I hope I've pronounced that right. Is it Eli? Is that how you pronounce that, Mike? I, and I'm not really good at pronouncing the name, so don't get offended if it's... going to uh, pause it and sub to Mike right now on my phone. Hold on a second, guys. Mike said, yeah, they did, uh, they did Mandy and VFW as well. I liked VFW. I thought it was decent. It, it wasn't great, but it was fun. It was good. It was fun. And Mandy, um, I'm going to have to watch that again because I, I did not really care for that one. And I know a lot of people did. A lot of people liked it. And 
Mike Eli. Are you a bodybuilder, Mike? I, there's a Mike Eli that's uh has a weightlifting channel. Oh wait, okay, right here. Oh, uh, Dice K Beppu gave you a shout out. A year ago it says hold on a second here. It said please check out our friend Mike Eli's great criterion video. I'm gonna click on that and then find you. There's your link. Awesome. I just subbed Mike. And I will definitely... Wow, you got a lot of views on it. You got over 8,000 views on that criterion. I'm going to watch that tonight for sure. All right, cool. Thanks, Mike. I am subbed, sir. Yeah, definitely, Mike. I wish I would have known sooner that you had a channel. You can't sneak up on these guys. Oh! <laughs> I guess that's what I get for trying to be cute. I get uh, blindsided. Yeah, I, I uh... I had that on my phone, Mike, where you, you could hear the audio, but I stopped it because I'm definitely going to check that out tonight. It looked like it was pretty long, too. Is that a long video? Let me see. Well, I, I can't pull it up right now again. I'm just at the moment. I'll, I'll pull it up. But it looked like you had quite a collection. And I do love Criterion. They're, they're easily one of the best companies. <laughs> Neil said Magnet also put out Hobo with the shotgun. That was a fun one. I was, I was shocked to see Rutger Hauer take a, a role like that, but he really played that role well. It was just, that movie was just wet. It was just bloody, blood-soaked. Mike said, uh, Dice K and I recently talked about doing an interview on his channel. Really excited about that. Yeah, he's a good, he's a good, uh, very good YouTuber. He knows his stuff. Mike said, no, nah, I kept it short six minutes. Okay. Yeah, Hobo with the shotgun was great. And rest in peace, Rutger Hauer. I can hear him. It's got to be close. There he is. going on here Ooh, a machete yeah I gotta take it Dogs inside that. Hey, buddy. <laughs> it's a little puppy. Hello. That's cool. How's it going, pal? Come here. What is that, a German Shepherd? Hey, buddy. 
Hello. Come here, buddy. Hi. Hello. All right, come here. Come here. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, my God. All right, all right, all right. It's fine. Have it your way. Okay. Yeah, Rucker Hauer passed away. It's been like a year or two now, I believe. Maybe like a year and a half or so. Yeah, time is flying. Stuart Gordon died a year ago already. Almost a year in March. Hey, huh, what? wake up, Ooh. you lazy bastard. What's going on, man? <laughs> what the this? Shit. Oh, shit. Hey. Hey, how you doing, little guy? Hey, oh, easy, easy. <laughs> hey, hey, hold on. Hold on. Huh? I like dogs better than people. Where'd you come from? <laughs> Not all people. Look at me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Most people. <laughs> hey, hey, you look a little thirsty. Let's, uh, let's get you some water. How's that sound? Hmm. Nice. That was kind of an uplifting little mission. Now let's go spray some blood. We'll go back to Copeland. Hey, Deke, you there? No, I need you to meet me. I'm here, Schizo. What do you want? I'm busy. Look, I know you're trying to help the camp. I'm trying to help you help the camp. Meet me at the back of the lodge. Schizo out. <laughs> Damn it, Schizo. This better be good. So I gotta go meet Schizo now. You got two labs, Mike. That's nice. The labs are smart. So smart. I got a Weimariner. They're almost... Almost identical to a lab in looks and size and smarts. A few weeks back, we were riding west along the old Belknap Road. Almost naked all the What am I supposed up. to do? Here, what do you want? Hold on. Come on, in here. Excuse me, what's going on? Well, if you go inside, I'll show you. Neil said we love Miss Hannah and Miss Heidi. They're they're good dogs, really sweet dogs. They're smart too, they listen. Hey, I've been thinking about your idea. You know the one where you want to seal the cave north of the camp to cut down on the hordes passing through our farm area? Okay. Problem is. Mike hasn't been able to find any deck cord for this, has he? No. But I know where you can get some. Right here. I don't trust this guy. He's a no. schemer. No, I know what you're <laughs> no. thinking. I get it. No, that's okay. in the middle of Ripper territory. Last time I went through there, You got it didn't... meds that saved your boy's no. life. We get the deck cord, we blow the cave, oh, goodbye, horde. Uh -huh. Neil it said was I have a cat named Hugo. Idea. That's Look, cool. They have sealed the <laughs> goddamn border. Cats they are sealed smart. The tunnel. If I go through they there, know how to shit in a box. I'm starting a war. That's pretty I smart. I've got a plan. Besides, I'm going with you. I keep your ass out of trouble. Just grab as much gear as you can. Hopefully we won't need it, but you never know. 
and then meet me here. Because there's a trail that goes over Iron Ridge. What? Right there. What are you talking about? Just trust me. Jesus. You in? I'll see you there. See if we can find this trail. Neil said a cat is like me. A cat is like me, 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 and a dog is like you, you, you. That's that's very true. That is very true. Oh, That's I well put. I'm a little got sick. Are you there? Yeah, Deacon, what's up? I, uh, I got Boozer the dog, and it worked, just like you said. <laughs> well, I'm glad. You know, you're a good friend, or he's lucky to have you. Hey, you there? Yeah, Booze Man, what's up? It's no worries, brother. I mean, it, it followed me, you know? Wouldn't leave me alone. What was I supposed to do? Hey, hey, get down. Hey. <laughs> yeah, oh. sure, it followed you. Going right into hey, the, uh, uh, the fog Jack. here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Jack would have loved that. Uh, no, he wouldn't have, which is why I did it. You out there? Uh, hey, Ricky. I've been looking for you. Finally got power back on to most of the camp, including my cabin. Great. Hey, I'm a... I even found an old water heater that works. I guess I'm gonna get my hot shower, yeah? Great, great. Hey, where are you? Uh, Skizzo and I... Oh, crap. I didn't mean to do that. That's why I stopped because I wanted to hear hey, the whole conversation. What are you doing? I got chased what we by are going to do is go in through their goddamn back door. On foot? You never told me we were going on foot. Remember what happened the last time you took your noisy ass bike in there? Good point. Hey, they'll never even see us. Mike said he's given so, off Jesse uh, Pinkman Iron Mike vibes. Said that he sent you to parlay with <laughs> Carlos. Wait, Mike's the got the references tonight. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Okay. I guess there's no harm in you being in the know, <laughs> seeing as how you and your bro are part of the camp now. Oh, it must have gone well, seeing as how we're just going in through what? What'd you call it? Their goddamn back door? 
So we're, what are we doing? Infiltrating a camp? A, like a marauder brief. camp? Oh, or? Yeah, it went swell. Like trying to negotiate with a barrel of monkeys all whacked out on PCP. But you know what? As long as we don't get caught tonight, the old man's treaty might just hold after all. Even though Boozer and I just had a run-in with them at Rogue Camp. Hey, Carlos said there was a mistake. Some rogue rippers. Get it? <laughs> anyway, he said it wouldn't happen again. And you believe him? <laughs> what the hell do I know? I'm just one of Mike's flunkies. Same as you. A wolf. Yeah, wolves. You think they're infected? Yes, I do. Yes, we're gonna find out. How'd you get through before? Yeah, there used to be a, an old wooden ladder left by miners or spelunkers or some shit. Come on. Over here. Boost me up. Hold on, I gotta go check this out over here. Nothing. Bandages. Yeah, I can always use this. Nice little place here. It's a camp. So I'm gonna boost him up and then the wolves are gonna come out at me. That's usually how it goes in these you ready? games. Ready? Yeah. Go. <laughs> Got it. Look around down there. See if that ladder's there somewhere. I'll take a look up here. Okay, hurry it up. We gotta be in and out of Ripper territory before it gets light. Yeah? Tell me something I don't know. I'm gonna put myself somewhere where they can't get me from behind. Wolves! Look out! I got him! I have not played this game before. I just, you could see that coming a mile away. You hear the wolves howling in the distance. Nope, I can hear another one growling. That's the last of them. I was going to say there's probably going to be an infected Schizo. one too, but maybe not. Schizo, where the hell are you? Hold on, hold on, I got it. Neil said, Todd, have you seen Once Upon a Time in Hollywood? Not yet. That's another one that's on my list. I heard really good things about that. I love Tarantino, so. I even like The Hateful Eight, and a lot, a lot of people gave that hate, but I, I enjoyed it. Watch your head. Got it. Like I said, I really enjoyed that film. Tarantino hasn't lost a step in his game. Hey, he's one of the best. And he's a good story, too, because he started out as a fanboy, just like most of us are, you know. But he actually had the means to go out and make movies how he wanted to make them. And he really did a great job. Pulp Fiction is one of the best films ever made, in my opinion. One of my favorites. some of these old Forest Service trails. I'm sure Iron Mike loves you rifling through his shit. What the old man doesn't know won't hurt him. Sure. Anyways, you can see the trail's in bad shape. It was marked on the map as closed. What do we got over here? Always got to scout for stuff. You never know. Am 
Mike said, Mike said, big Tarantino fan as well. <coughs> yeah, he's he's really been uh, same as Adam Green too. You know, he's another kind of a fanboy who started making movies, and he really yeah, did a great job. A Ripper bonfire. You ever seen one before? No. They call it a gathering. Heard they do all kind of messed up crap. <laughs> Let's go around. I don't want any part of that. How with that? I want to see it. What? You got a death wish? Not anymore. Look, I just I want to see for myself what these assholes go through. You know, rest in peace, place? get low, all that shit. Okay, okay. But you this is a freaker me. village you or whatever separated. you call it. We're in deep shit. <laughs> Following you. Don't get caught. Let me, I gotta go scout here, guys. I have to. See, there's a couple things over there. Sometimes if you go out of your way a little bit, you find something cool that you you might have needed, you know what I mean? I need more scrap and I need more of the... Neil said had a Tarantino marathon from Kill Bill 2 up to Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. That had to be a great night or a couple days. I don't know how long it took you, but it had to be a lot of fun. And then Mike said saw Reservoir Dogs and Pulp Fiction when I was 15, and they really made me fall in love with cinema. Me too, Mike. I saw them at early ages, both of those movies. I, I have them on Blu-ray, and I actually saw them on VHS back in the day. And uh, Pulp Fiction... The first time I saw it, I was kind of like, what the hell? Well, you know, because they kind of, they filmed that movie out of sequence on purpose, but everything ties together so beautifully at the end. You almost have to see it two or three times to kind of understand the whole thing. And when you do, it's a masterpiece. It's really a, a, a great piece of, of cinema history. And Reservoir Dogs. How can you not like Reservoir Dogs? All-star cast, great music. I can't if you want. It was, a, it was a wet movie, a bloody movie. Fight Evil, what's up, man? Fight Evil said, let's talk about the Mighty Ducks movie. <laughs> Probably the only thing good about that. Well, yeah, I mean, I'm... They're fun movies. They're Disney movies. Why do I have a can of gas in my hand? Uh, Emilio Estevez is a good actor, but I know you were being sarcastic, but I, I can't really hate on a Disney movie. They had a couple sequels for that too, didn't they? The Mighty Ducks, two or three sequels. These freakers are nuts. I hope I can destroy them at the end. Yeah, they're like, uh, Neil said they're making a new Mighty Ducks movie. I think that whole family, that whole Sheen, Estevez family, were some great actors. Like Eli said, I have a complete Tarantino steelbook collection. You should make a video on that. I would love to see that. What the fuck? I think there's a trailer out for a reboot. It's a TV show. Really? I had a guy who went to one of the rituals or whatever the fuck. He said that the rivers are jacked up on some, some PCP or something. They don't feel the pain. Well, let's go around. So these guys thinking. are always snorting some kind of dust in the palm of their hand, and they get all goofy. You ever see anything like that before? It's ripped apart. No, not like that. Me either. Keep your friends That's close. Our heads down. We get caught out here. There ain't enough bullets to take them down. I hear ya. We could kill those guys pretty easy. But that's all of them, unless there's a dozen more, maybe. You know something's going to happen. That was too easy. It's 
Jesus. Get down, get down, shit. We gotta get off the road. Yeah. Come on. We'll head cross country. You sure you know where you're going? It's me. I have a feeling this guy's setting us up somehow. I, I just don't but trust sure this Schizo. Is the right way. Mike yeah. said, I actually just watched Why? Dead Presidents. I used to ride through Martin here Sheen has a day. great cameo as what? the judge in the final My scene. My old lady used to work out here. There was a research lab east of Iron Butte Lodge. Anyway, I'd ride White out Eagle here. I said, swear the men at work is a decent Sheen Estevez combo. Just keep going. You'll see. It's Charlie, Sh Charlie Sheen really screwed shit up when he did all that uh, tiger blood. That that show that he was on, Two and a Half Men, was gold. That mo that show was so great. I laugh out loud every episode I watch, and he ruined that. But he's a great actor. Fight Evil said for some reason I watched Sheen's uh, coked out interview again last night. <laughs> that guy lived about ten lives in one life, Charlie Sheen. Rippers, they use air horns to attract freaks. Come on. Am I getting set up here on this mission? I got a really bad feeling he's setting me up. He's going to take off on me. What the fuck? Is that a girl? Oh, they're gonna sound rippers or uh. No, no, leave him! Leave him! We are not here to start a war. Give me a second. Give me a second. Oh, Jesus. Somebody! Someone, please! Come on. Please! Come on, we gotta go. Oh, we no, gotta no, save no, her. The freaks. What? No. This is Jesus, we are not leaving. This it all depends. Is it a horde here. or is it a couple of freaks? If it's a horde, we gotta go. Shit. Yeah, okay. Okay. <laughs> Hurry up, guys. Okay. You got her. I got her. What? Shut up. Oh, her knees are all busted. Uh, her legs are broken. She ain't going anywhere, bro. We're gonna have to carry her. Or shoot her. We gotta get a move on. Man, that's Just crazy. This game is deep, huh? What do you do? Hey, sweetheart. Sweetheart? I gotta shoot You're her. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. It's fine. It's okay. It's okay. Kind of like that uh, the scene when Tony Soprano suffocated uh, Malta Santi. Oh man, that's this game is so deep. At least you didn't have to get uh, torn apart. We gotta come back this way. Mike said, Charlie and Martin were phenomenal in Wall Street. There's a scene in the elevator. The scene in the elevator is really iconic, and I highly recommend watching it with their... It, it got cut off, Mike. But you're right. That is a great movie and a great scene. Okay. I know what you're talking about. Yeah, I'm fine. You did the right thing, you know. Just drop it, Schizo. We've all had to do. Drop I, it. I think Martin is still with us, right? Martin Sheen is still with us. I think Kirk Douglas is the one that passed away recently. I always got those two kind of confused a little bit. They're kind of dynasty fathers of dynasty actors. And I think uh, Kirk Douglas just passed away a year or two ago at like 100, 101 years old or something like that. Oh, shit, get down, get down. Jesus, what now? Oh. Oh. It's a fucking horde. No, that ain't no lord. What the fuck? 
Because Rippers. He's coming. He's coming. What the hell? Yes, Martin Sheen was awesome in Apocalypse Now. You just got that on 4K, didn't you, Niels? You're batshit fucking crazy. You ever seen their leader, Carlos? Apocalypse no. Now on 4K. He looks crazier than any of them. Got scars all over his back, arms, legs. Can I loot some stuff in here? Like you can't have a treaty with crazy people. I told you, Schizo, I'm not going against Iron Mike. Okay, there's gas. There's a, a bin to hide in. Two bins to hide in. Yeah, Martin's still alive. I was pretty sure about that. I know uh, it was uh, Kirk Douglas who passed away. Come on. There's got to be another way in. Hey, hold up. Let's take a look around. What are you talking about? Well, we have no idea what's in there, so let's look around. We are many. We, we are one. The yeah. lost yeah, wall okay, sure. fall. Why not? The lost will take fall. Take a look around and uh, see if you can find anything. Neil said, and it looks so... Looks and sounds awesome on 4K. That'll probably be one I do upgrade onto 4K. The last one I upgraded to 4K was the Goonies, and that looked really good. That was great. Think. Try this door. Lock it tight. Wait, wait, wait! Slow down. You don't know what's in there. He went in there. Can I close it? This time of night, it is clear. I never saw it. It was on me so fast. Another gas can. What is this? A little office. I'm going to grab that gas can and bring it with me just in case I need to uh, make an explosive out here. Holy cow, it's a six disc set? Wow. I don't know why I don't have that already. Ooh, okay, there's a little this might come in handy. I gotta know all this kind of stuff. Probably gonna get attacked out here. I wanna put that gas can kind of out in the middle in case I have to shoot it. That can happen. There's a couple of them. Where was the other one? Yeah, I guess. Hey, Deke. Put it right here, maybe. I owe you one. I mean it. Ah, uh, forget it. Let's just go get the dead cord. And... Oh, what? I didn't know. Here, help me. We can get in through here. Oh, I don't know, man. I wasn't finished looking around yet. Fine. <laughs> Nukes. Who knows what else? Are we still going in there? 
We got a choice. You ready? Let me look around first. Pull. <laughs> You get under, I'll hold it. No, 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 you oh, go. No. I got it. Go, go, go. go. Okay. Hey, hold it for me. Ah, oh, shit. God damn it. Yeah, it's jammed. Pull. Yeah, it's jammed. apart. Okay. No, that's all right. All right, uh, go around. I'll find a way to open the side door from here. Here. Deke! Deke! Oh, shit. Bastard, you. Are they coming through that ceiling? Sledgehammer. <laughs> Take out those little kids with a big sledgehammer.
Neil said, that's not good. Fight Evil said, they're little guys. You can just blast them all. Neil said, we represent the Lollipop, <laughs> the Lollipop Guild. And Mike said, that almost sounded like R2-D2 screaming. Almost. Let's see if I can find some stuff up here. Locked inside a warehouse with a bunch of pissed off nudes. What do you think's going on? Who was he talking to? <laughs> the thing about those nudes is they're little, but they're quick and they cling. They, they jump on you and they really do a lot of damage. So you can't just kind of run in there willy nilly like that. You have to kind of take them apart one at a time. At least I do. I can't. I'm not good enough to just go in there and blast them all. I was hoping there would be some good loot up here though, but I don't see anything. Not even a bullet or anything. Let's see if I can get the door open for Schizo. That's not going to work. I thought I could jump up there maybe and this here. I guess not. What about this? No? Can I get under here? Yep. That did it. Here, here, the door's unlocked. Jesus, you okay? Yeah, just a little newt, right? Oh. Come on. Yeah, let's just uh, find the dead cords. What do you think? Foreman's office is up there. That's where they'd keep it. Oh, great. How are we gonna get up there? Well, I'll give you a boost, uh, come on. Come on, I'll give you a boost. Wait, wait, you just want me to go first, in case there's something up there. Okay, you give me a boost. Oh, you got me. Now, come on. Yeah, okay. All right, you ready? Yeah. Up. Okay, up. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, I'm up. Give me a sec. Find okay. something I can use to climb up. Crap. Remember that hole in the ceiling? Here. Watch oh. your head. Not so hard. Hey, this has got to be it. Bingo. Here, hold this open while I grab it. Why don't I just grab it? Why you so long? Trust me. As a matter of fact, I do. Come on, let's get the hell out of here. Schizo, I, uh, I just want to say thank you. Nah, nah, man. For coming out here with me, helping out. Jesus, just... No, I mean it. I mean, we weren't exactly welcome at Lost Lake. Just drop it, okay? Over here, there was a. Oh, it's outside, right? All right, Skizzle, once we get back to camp, why don't you look? What are you doing? Sorry, is the only way. <laughs> Thank you. 
I knew it. I had a feeling about that guy, Schizo. I had a feeling about him. So what is he working with the Rippers? Look at this. Do you know who I am? No. I thought Rippers don't have names. We are on the path. My followers. My followers have all given up their names. Except for me. For now. Uh -huh. Carlos. <laughs> oh, shit. How am I going to get out of this one? Jesse, what the fuck? Jesse from Jesse and the Rippers? I Jesse kept my and the name. Pussycats? And I kept my memories of how you and Boozer and Jersey Jim held me down. Well, Jack took a torch to my back. Jesse, that was a long time ago. We didn't really... Oh! Oh. Oh. oh! oh, yeah. I remember screaming, it's okay. I also remember something else I learned that day. Something important. Everything about you. Everything that makes you who you are. Oh. It can be burned away. Until nothing remains but your name. That's what the freaks are, you know. I learned that too. That's why we need to be just like them. Okay. If we're gonna do this, you're gonna talk me to death. <laughs> oh. We are gonna do this. How do I get out of this one? Job. We are not going to do this alone, no, are we? No! No! We're going to do this without booze, are we? We got to finish this together, the three of us. One down. And what? About a dozen to go. Maybe more. What are the odds? The three of us, you, me, Boozer, still alive. I don't remember this guy. together here at the end of the world. What the fuck have you done to Boozer? Oh. He's not here yet. But he will be. Soon enough. Was this guy part of the early story? Because I don't remember him. <clears throat> oh, that's Lisa. It is you. That's the little girl we saved. No. That's not my name. I'm on the path. I don't have a name anymore. <laughs> None of us do. Fight evil. Hold Everyone. on a second. I'll read it in a second. I ever cared about. Is dead. Lisa. Listen to me. Do you know? Why we want to be like them, like the freaks? No. It's because they don't remember what Get they've lost. On their ass. Who they've lost. Nice. She helped us. Yeah. 
Fight, Fight Evil said it would have been ballsy if they just let him torture you and kill you and then roll the credits. <laughs> Let me hurry up and, uh, where did he put all my stuff? There's nothing in here for me to take. So I got a knife in my hand. And I have no health. My health bar is almost empty and I have no health supplies. Lisa. Shh. She's gone. They're probably killing her. Say on the wall. Your body is an empty vessel. We One. <laughs> One with the free. One mind. What the hell is wrong with these assholes? <laughs> Obey the exalted one. Tremble. We are many, we are one. I hope they're not uh, torture and boozer. Look at this, you guys are animals. Why would he give up? The pain will set you free. Your body. We carve it to set you free. Got it.
take a golf club. Could probably do some serious damage with a big ass golf club instead of a little knife, but they wouldn't let me take one. How the hell am I gonna get out of here? Oh. Should I try to kill these guys or I try to jimmy this door open? said I'm gonna I'm not gonna kill you I'm just gonna bash your head in <laughs> that was on uh, The Shining I watched that recently on 4k too that's a good movie it's a classic he said he was gonna bash her effing bash your effing head in or something like that Hey, let us play is in the house, guys. Let's welcome him. Good to see you. This is it. This has got to be it. Oh, who's that? See something. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, come on. I was crouched. Why was he standing now? Mike said, I think it's bash your brains, and it could be. I thought there was an F bomb in there, but I could be wrong about that. Donato sent me that movie. The 4K release of The Shining. <laughs> All right, what am I supposed to do here now?
Mike said afterwards, he said, bash him right the F in. Okay, that, that sounds about right, Mike. I think you're absolutely right. I just saw that too, and I couldn't remember that. Can I get in here? There's some stuff in there. Those doors are locked. So I think I'm going to have to try to stealthily take these guys out one by one. I don't know. Let's see if I can start with this guy here. Us only is in the house. He said, toss things. I, I don't have anything, buddy. They took me hostage and they took all my weapons, my healing. I got nothing on my inventory but a knife. So I have to try to go through in stealth mode and kill these guys and try to find my stuff. They took my clothes, everything. Good to see you, us only. I'm supposed to go to the... I think they said the objective was to go to the campfire, but I don't know... If this is where my stuff is. place said rogue thieves assassin class are my second favorite class to play first being mage bottles bricks yeah, I don't have any of that stuff um, look at my inventory is empty I got a boot knife do I have a gun no they took I guess I do have rocks in my inventory that's weird I thought everything was gone. Someone's here. What? Put me way back here too. Oh, we follow Carlos. I saw someone.
I'm free. So have a nice evening, Todd. Talk to you later. Thank you, uh, Niels, for joining us, and you have a good night too, my friend. Hope to see you soon. fast. No, no, switch to easy mode. No. Mike said, this reminds me of the Key and Peel neck snapping sketch. Look that one up if you haven't seen it. I'll have to check it out. Looks like they were sending me over here.
I'll take that. Go to sleep. I've got a question for you. What's the deal? Huh? You just drag people in here, fuck with them, steal their shit. And then what, take it all and throw in the bonfire out there? Is that the idea? Jesus Christ. Oh, hello. <laughs> yeah. Got another question. <laughs> Where's my cut? What? My cut, my leather jacket, my fucking leather jacket. Who took it? Don't? No. Okay. Wait, 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 he just left. He just took it and left not long ago. Join us, brother. Join us. Oh. This is it. Alright. What of this way? He just left. He is released. Oh, yeah, I want to look around a little bit before I. There's got to be some good stuff in here. stuff back though <coughs> nothing good in here at all Back. They all respond. I gotta kill them all again. Still can't get in there. Do I still have to worry about getting caught? Or can I just go in here now and start hacking? Let's see, we'll give it a shot. Oh, I can't shoot. I don't have any bullets. I don't have any bullets. Alright, still gotta be in stealth mode. Take a closer look. Okay, let's see. What's going on this way? He just left. These are fresh.
Gosh. Hey. <laughs> Do me a favor. Take that shit off. <laughs> we will cut away your soul. Okay, Hellraiser. Thanks. Shit. Oh, we will rip apart. What is the, the line on Hellraiser? Eat your soul, or we will Something. rip apart your soul. What was that? Something's not right. We gather at the rising. We follow Carlos. No. What? Still have to be. Why well, I gotta be in stealth mode? I have guns and machete. Hey, what's up, Rob? Yeah, these aren't these are not zombies. These are called rippers. They're humans who want to be zombies so they cut themselves they torture themselves with their they're still living beings but they're uh, they snip this white powder I'm not sure what it is and they get all goofy killing the same people over and over in this mission. Listen nice to me. Move. Okay. They know you freed me. It's not safe here. So come on. Come no. on. 
Fine, don't come with me, but you can't stay here. You have to run because they will kill you. Do you understand me? Yeah. Go! you can. Stay off the roads. Keep moving no matter what. Go. Raise the thunder. Look at all the stuff in here now. up on everything let's see I can repair my machete got it okay got all my health stuff back wow we're back in the game guys what else make some more bandages Molotovs. Nice. What else is in here? Anything else? I wish Lisa would have came back with me. That's the only thing I regret in this mission. Now hopefully I'm not... I don't have to be in stealth mode anymore. if you can hear me. Look, it's Schizo. He sold me out. The Rippers. Boozer, they're coming. Warn Iron Mike. I bet you Schizo has the radio right now. that bike and take it to my bike. Oh, my bike's right up the road. Let's see if I can go sabotage this bike. wolves again. Who's 
got the spotlight down there. I think those are zombies right there. My wolf meat. I guess I probably should have taken that red motorcycle. Then again, those are rippers. Those are rippers and they're they're um, attacking a zombie. Or are the zombies attacking the rippers? These are good for experience points, though. I gotta get back to my bike. Music change, something's going on. Must be in 4A for a little battle here coming up. Mike is still 463 meters away. I should have definitely taken a motorcycle. Does that say on the side of that uh, semi, that tractor trailer, it says bear or back? I can't really read that. So if there's more zombies attacking freakers, there's a freaker standing there with a flashlight watching 
another freaker get torn apart by a zombie. cycle. Yeah. I'm still going to keep walking though. There's a lot of experience points out here. We're almost there now, so. LXG said, my pro gets so low UD for this game, it's unbearable. Hmm. How does the quality look for you guys right now? Is the picture quality and the sound quality pretty good? cans in here. Rob said the quality is good and the sound is good. And so is the sound. Okay. Thank you. Alright, I've loaded up pretty good. More bullets. Good thing that I did uh, walk instead of take the bike anyway, after all, because. be interesting to see now what happens with Schizo when I go back into camp. Or if he got a hold of... If he got a hold of Boozer. Goodbye, you nightmare world.
What a nightmare this place was. There's a bunch of them over here. Oh, you know what? Is this a... Uh, is this where the horde feeds? Because i got to hurry up and get the crap out of here. If that's... going to start coming by the hundreds or thousands. It was by that house with a bonfire. That's why I don't get it why how a zombie could kill a freaker when it takes me three hits to kill a freaker and two to kill a zombie. This is it. One if I'm stealthy. Let's see I shouldn't if I can. let Schizo talk me into that shit. Let me see if I can kill a couple more of these guys Such just for idiot. experience. Should have seen it coming. I'm gonna play for another hour and a half yeah, anyway, so Schizo get the drop on me. all good points. See if there's anything good in here. <laughs> no, I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna play an hour and a half more right now. Rob said we all know you're gonna stay up another three hours. I've been playing already for, for you. two and a half hours exactly, so I'm going to play for four total.
Ripper axe has more does more damage than my machete, and it's as durable. Mm. So I have to take that. That's the first time I've seen one of those. He's got like a little stash of goodies over here. For once, they do. It does pay to explore a little bit. to another enemy territory. I went up the ridge instead of that little valley. There's rippers down there and zombies. Peaceful little campground or whatever back there. Should have done more than burn that cat off, Jesse. Should have slit your goddamn throat.
almost there. Boozer. Lost Lake Camp, come in. Schizo's on his way with Rippers. Do you read me? Does anybody read me? Damn it, Lost Lake. Damn it! Water camp over here. Check this out. Nothing here. There's my bike. Boozer, are you there? Ricky, Lost Lake Camp, is anyone there? Yeah, it's me. Wait, hold on. The Rippers are after Boozer. Dig? No, 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 no. Hey, hey the Dukes, what's up? It's Deacon. My mic sent us to find you. Rippers! Keep going! I'll keep him off you. We need to get back to the camp. Don't worry, I got this. You gotta stop him! Switch guns. More rippers coming right at us. I see him. Got a car on fire. We're trying to block the road. Go around. Stop. You got that? Oh no. Can you switch guns when you're driving? When you're riding? Because I ran out of bullets. Deacon, Mike sent riders to find you. Ricky, the Rippers are after Boozer. Deacon? No, 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 no. Hey, hey, don't shoot. It's Deacon. My Mike sent us to find you. Rippers! Keep going! I'll keep them off you. We need to get back to the camp. Don't worry, I got this! I gotta stop them! Thank <laughs> you. 
this gate. Got that? The main bridge. I'm gonna split off here. I'm gonna go in on the footbridge across the marsh. If you see Boozer, you tell him the Rippers are there for him. You got it? Copy that. Hey, St. John. Good luck. You too. And if you see Schizo, you kill that son of a bitch. Monsters. No more guns. Hey, hey, no, 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 it's fine, it's fine, ain't deep, you're gonna be okay, you're gonna be okay, now listen, listen, look at me, look at me, I'm looking for Boozer and Schizo, do you know them? Do you know where they are? I don't know, I don't know, okay, everything just, just happened so, so fast, they, they, were, they were everywhere, they, the Rippers, they were all over the, the camp, and they were huh? torturing us, they, yeah. they took me, they, they took Chad, and Eric, and Flint. Hey, listen, what's your name? Nicole. Nicole, do you know how to use a gun? Yeah. Okay. You see that tower up there? I want you to go up there. I want you to lay down. When the rippers come through here, you blow their goddamn heads off. I'm gonna go find your friends. Okay? Go. Okay. That did it.
Hostage got killed. Here and shoot the I forgot how to use focus. How do you use focus? It's R one, right? Thing they gave me a quiet, no time for a year to shoot her. You guys know Nicole, right? All right, listen to me. Head west to the footbridge. She's up in the watchtower. You go there, you help. I don't want any more rippers coming in through the marsh. You got it? You're a godsend. I was praying so hard. Good. Then go. Go. All right, Nicole. I did my All part. these other people are dead. <laughs> Loser. Loser. Ricky, anyone? Dick. I thought I lost you. Ricky, where's Boozer? Where's Schizo? I don't know what's going on. I saw Schizo with Boozer. Where? Where, Ricky? I don't know. Dick. Rippers. They're breaking into the infirmary. Damn. Wait for me. Oh, wow. That was a good one. Damn it, Ricky. I never saw that before. Bring him low. I gotta get to That was pretty good. Meanwhile, I'm getting shot in the back. Down.
gotta be kidding me. Are you serious? Duty artillery. Must have bumped it up a level or something.
game went from easy to impossible. So this is tough. This is where don't. the story gets really Let interesting. Go. Please, don't. You're all lost. lost. You're not kidding. No, that no, was no, tough. No. I guess I probably could have bypassed a lot of that just running straight to this point. I thought I had to kill everybody. I think I took a lot of unnecessary damage by trying to. I thought we were gonna stay inside. I heard someone yelling. I just, I just couldn't let him die. Wait, 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 wait. Hold up, hold up. What the hell was that? It's over. Yeah, Iron Mike negotiated a ceasefire. Wait, what? What the hell is going on? Let's go find out. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm sorry. About everything. Oh, God, me too. Mike, this is all just a big misunderstanding. They only want... You attacked my camp. Murdered my people. You call that a misunderstanding? Oh, you broke our treaty. You come onto our land. We you steal our supplies. A you attack you, you are my son of a bitch. Mike, listen to me. I made a deal. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, weapons, get the low, weapons brother. down. Get low. Hold. Hi, Skizzo. I'd like to hear about that deal. God damn it. Just wait. Why don't you tell him? Tell him how you sold us out to them. What the hell do you want me to do? Oh, fucking god damn it, Skizzle. Why don't you tell him or I'm gonna cut your throat? Okay. Okay! I made a deal with Carlos. Okay? Mike. But it wasn't. It wasn't to sell out the camp. I swear. It was just them. The two of them. Him and Boozer. That's all that he wants. Just them. Yeah, how's that deal working out for you? I did it to save the camp, Mike. I did it to fix shit, to restore the treaty he broke. Mike. Jake. It's good to see you breathing, but let him go. Deke. Okay. Okay, so... Is what he says true? About you making a deal? Only lost ten lives. Yeah. It's true. Okay. So we give you Deke. William. Biker boats, whatever the fuck you want to call them. But you leave Lost Lake alone. You will rest in peace. You have my word. And that's something, isn't it? Your word. Grand fucking poobah, the R.I.P. Hey, hey, we come here under a flag of truth. Truce my ass! This is my camp. My people. You don't come here with some blood-stained flag of truce and demand shit! Not from me! Now, I don't care what you think these boys have done. I don't care why you want them. All I know is you're not getting them. Nice. We had a deal. No, this is the deal. Shoot him. Carlos. And it's the only one you're getting. Now you take your people, and you get the hell out of Lost Lake. Or we all die together. Right here. Right now. Our treaty stands. Always has. From where I'm standing. You son of a bitch! Loser! All right. Escort them out of my fucking camp. What are they gonna do with Schizo? Hey, uh... We ain't through. Carlos. Get low, brother. Deke, <laughs> stand aside. Stand aside! Mike, look, I, 
I just want to say. Oh yeah, hell yeah. That felt good. Taking the lockup. Oh, fuck that. We'll take care. Get off him! I keep trying to tell you boys something, and you won't listen. This is not how we do things around here. We do not barter with lives, and we do not murder people in cold blood. Get him out of here. Get off me. We're gonna give him a fair trial. Like civilized people. And he's gonna get what's coming to him. I'm not sorry, Mike. I'm not. God damn it, I tried. I tried to save his camp. The Rippers won't stop. Carlos is not gonna stop. You hear me? They won't stop! You know who that was? Jesse. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess being a cult leader at the end of the world wasn't enough to keep him busy. He was after some payback as well. That motherfucking son of a bitch. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm guessing he's known about us for quite some time. That night at Crazy Willie's, that wasn't some random ripper attack. And Skizzy was gonna sell us out to him? Where'd they take him? I'm gonna find him and break his fucking oh, neck. Hold up, please, Skizzo, for right now. Get your gear together. Some monotiles, all the ammunition you can carry. But what are you thinking? And I already know it's a bad idea. Yeah, it's a bad idea. idea, but we're gonna do it anyway. I need to go and get the explosives from the lodge and then that court from Skizzo's cabin. Meet me at the bridge. I'll explain on the way. Hey, you good with this, brother? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Nice. That was a fun mission. That was a really long mission and a tough mission, but it was fun. Yeah, Ricky, I'm here. Hey, listen, I don't have time. What the hell happened? I just saw them locking Schizo up and I... Yeah? Good. Now I don't have time to talk. And Carlos and all the Rippers just rode out after everything they did. Yeah? Okay, great. Talk to Iron Mike about that bullshit. I will, but I need to talk to you. I don't want you doing anything. Look, Ricky, you are talking to me. Face to face, Deke. It's important. It's always important. Ricky, look, I gotta go. Deacon, wait! Sorry, Ricky. We're gonna talk again later, all right? Deacon out. Oh, I gotta go. The Duke said, have you used your points? I did yesterday. I used all of them. I got one now I can use. I'll go and do that now. Uh, any suggestions? I got another one too. Uh, ah, it doesn't matter. What did you drop?
Oh, you know what? Maybe I should keep that big ass gun. Hey, I'm gonna. I don't know how much ammo I have though for that one. Let me see. I only have nine. It's a good gun. I don't know how practical it is though if I can't get ammo for it. Let's go ahead and keep moving on. How do I ever trust this asshole? Hello. This schizo won't be needing this. fixed up. Can't let it get infected. We know what that means. Well, only one name on my shit list, Schizo. Yours. Graduated with honors, what? I knew he wasn't a gangbanger. Oh. Mm. I can't do this anymore. It's okay, I'm fine. What's going on? I'm a goddamn veterinarian. I went to school to cure colic and heaves and hoof diseases. Does this look like a fucking hoof to you? Addie? No, Addie? you saw what happened to Boozer. I can't do this. Hey, Addie. So many wounded. Addie. And so many die. Addie. Oh, Deacon, I am not a doctor. Okay, maybe not. But you're all we've got. The Duke said you get that gun later in much better condition. It's good for the hordes. Okay, good. Thank you for letting me know. That is a great gun. What is that, a 50 cal? So that he's not a doctor. Huh? Um, okay, so you're not a doctor. You oh, that's... still save Boozer's life. No, they gave me... Uh, that's got to count for something. They gave me Schizo's weapon now. They took the other one away, it looks like. Let me sell my Oh, they're not in business anymore because of that little war we had. Hey. Do 
you think the freaks remember anything about their life, you know, from before? They're like a bunch of Alzheimer's patients, only pissed off, stronger, and who want to tear your guts out. Hey, Deke. So I'm gonna go check on the explosives to make sure, you know, the Rippers didn't steal them, and then I went to Schizo's cabin to check on the deck cords, but I should've just come straight here and saved some time. Get the hell out of here, Ricky. Guess we can go blow up that cave, right? I'll come with you. <sighs> when I was a kid, my dad found a rat's nest underneath one of our sheds. You wanna know what he did? Can't even guess. Well, I waited till morning. They'd all be asleep. He laid a piece of plywood over the hole and told me to go get the garden hose. And he said to me, I never forget what he said to me. He said the best way to kill a rat's nest is to drown him. You can blow up the reservoir above the camp? Oh, that's an idea. Deacon, you can't. They want to rest in De peace. I'm going to help them out. Deacon, you can't do that. Why is that? Because Iron Mike? Is this some fucking treaty? You know, I want to cut Schizo's throat, but he's right about one thing. Carlos ain't going to stop. Rippers ain't going to stop. And you know it. Are you sure this isn't personal? Fuck yeah, it's personal. <laughs> okay. This game is awesome. The Duke said, I suggest you get the butcher skill. It gives you more meat from animals. Loser, I'm heading to the gate. You ready? Which you okay. can sell I'm and get, there. get a 50 cal sniper, which is awesome. Okay, I don't think I have that available yet, but if I do or when I see it, I'll definitely. That's just my dog in the background. I think she's freaking out. She's wondering why I'm talking to myself. It's okay. Nice rifle. Oh, yeah, a present from Schizo. Remind me to be there when you give it back to him. He'll be there. <laughs> that goddamn Schizo. So what are we gonna do with the bastard? I mean, we're not letting Iron Mike put him on trial, are we? No, we're not. All right, so what's the plan? Well, it's going to end up screwing I everything know the up area with Mike. Pretty well. Sarah, uh, she worked out of a lab south of Iron Butte Ranch. I used to ride out there, pick her up for lunch. Carter ride on some of those back roads. Jesse, Carlos, whatever the hell he's calling himself. He's taken over the old golf course and resort. Just south of the lodge is the Crescent Lake Reservoir. Now, if we blow that dam, that lake's gonna flood down into the valley and it's gonna drown them all, like rats. Okay, but isn't the lodge up on a hill? Yeah, yeah, flood probably won't do much to it, but it'll do enough damage to the rest of the Ripper compound to take out most of his men. And if Jesse survives, he won't see us coming. Got it. Okay, just for the record. Now we just gotta figure out how to get into the Iron Butte Valley without being seen, yeah? I'll get us there. You just hang on. I was gonna say, for the record, I am all for blowing up this place, but I do think Mike should have a fair trial for Schizo and see where that trial goes before we do anything drastically to affect our relationship with Mike and that camp. Because if we go through and just take Schizo and kill him or do whatever, Mike will be done with us. And that's pretty much the sweetest camp out of, what is it, three or four camps? That's my favorite one anyway. I, 
I don't know if it's the best, but it's my favorite. Lose my uh, lose my weapon. Mine too. Tucker is a slave trader. Yeah, I don't like her. I don't like the way she treated that uh, Lisa. I understand everybody has to work and everybody has to pull their weight, but considering what she just went through and the fact that her, the fact that her mom and dad were missing and she was just a kid out in the wasteland, she could have been a little more lenient on her. Copeland, he's kind of a uh, conspiracy theorist. Okay? He may not be wrong all the time. I don't know. I haven't really, better. you know, I didn't really research everything he was saying, but right behind you. Which one is better? Um, the one I have is better. This game got considerably harder um, over the last couple times I played. It was actually kind of a, a breeze, a walkthrough, and all of a sudden now it's getting to the point where these, these rippers are no joke. sure that the Duke said it gets tougher I believe it I mean just those hordes alone I don't know how I'm gonna be able to got it clear out those swarms of hordes the one that I got earlier was kind of by luck and it was a small horde some of the other ones were just I don't know how I'm gonna there's that that wood mill or whatever. There's two missions I got to do now. One of them is to clean the horde out, and the other one is to um, have to collect a bounty on somebody over there. And I don't know how I'm going to do either one of those. We got to head south from here. Following you. <laughs> um. 
But, uh, you know, I like games that have a challenge. I don't want to just be able to walk through a game. I mean, I don't want to... I got killed a couple times earlier, and it asked me if I wanted to go down a level in difficulty, and I'm not going to do that either. I here? There's a couple of bounties I want to get. I hope I'm not being timed on this. now or can, should I come back? Is that all of them? Is there a way you can shut the lights off too? Duke said there is no time limit so you can explore. Okay, cool. I just want to grab this really quick because I don't know when I'll be back and I want to get that, that upgrade. What about the lights? Is there a way that I can turn off the lights on these little compounds here? Because I don't think I've been doing that. And it, it still attracts some of the uh, freakers or whatever they're called. Duke said, don't think you can turn off lights. Okay. Just gotta find the... Okay, there's a gas can. I just have to find the generator. Going real quick and get that. There's a generator right there. Hope I got all the speakers. We'll find out here in a second. Hmm. Here we go. Hmm. 
I should be it. Is that one of those screamers? Boozer didn't make it. Game over. You okay? Uh, I've been better. All right, come on. We gotta finish this. Right behind you. later. We gotta head south from here. Following you. Here a speaker. What part of the map are we on? Oh, we're way out here, okay. I got about 20, 25 more minutes before I shut the uh, live stream off.
What are you doing? Figured I'd take this bag of explosives down there and ask them if they didn't mind us, you know, blowing them the fuck up. Boozer. Look, you stay up here with Schizo's rifle and keep them off me while I set the charges. Oh, hold, hold on. Look, I got this. I'm not much good in a firefight, but I can plant these charges. I've set demo charges before, Boozer, in Afghanistan. I know exactly where to put them. Good. Tell me where to go when I'm down there. We're doing this? Yeah. All right. Okay, I'm gonna be up in this tower. Should give me a good view of the entire dam. I'll wait here until you get up there. All right, let's do this. Holding on top of the dam. Ah, got it. I'm heading there now. I gotta do headshots. Right. I'm setting the first charge. Or I'm gonna run out of ammo. Done. All right, I'm moving on to the next one. Nice job. Ah. Keep going. Rippers, coming. some kind of a glitch here.
restart the mission. Very important to do headshots in this mission. You got this. I got him. But it's hard, they move around. Guy here with this cannon on his back. That's the person coming. Yeah, yeah. Oh, rippers. I got this blizzard. Oh, rippers. I see him. to zoom, what do you mean? Oh, L3. Third charge. Oh, okay. Position. Gotcha. Move your ass. All right, where okay, do you go? Try doing this with one hand and a blade. Hey, come on, man. Sometimes I wish I had a blade Thanks, hand. Thanks, Dukes. I hear you. I got you. Try it, loser. It's not that easy. Fourth charge. I think you might have saved me a little bit of frustration, Dukes. Right with that uh, L3 zoom. <laughs> He's always got jokes about that arm. <laughs> well, that never gets old, does it? What's up? Am I going to be able to get Let's that Nero find, trailer now? Is it going to be flooded out? Let's 
see. If I can go back to that Nero trailer. Actually, let me go see if I can do that real quick. I still have a little bit of time left on the stream to do that. You, uh, you did a hell of a job back there. Yeah? yeah? I thought I was done for a couple of times. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. What the hell are you talking about? This is the most alive I've felt since... Ah, uh, shit. You remember when we got trapped by that horde in Tumalo? We ain't done yet. How many you think we killed? I don't know. They had it coming, right? Yeah, they had it coming. Guess we all do. Oh. Ten more minutes. Looks like we go in on foot from here. You wanna stay? Keep any stray rippers from ripping off my bike? Yeah, I don't think we need to worry about that. And fuck that. This? This is on Jesse. You want some payback? Ooh, are we gonna barely get him? Let's show him some fucking payback. Come on, let's head to the lodge. Like I said. Right behind you. Jesus. This must be what it looked like after Noah's flood. Came and washed away all the wicked. Yeah, except God had nothing to do with this one. Yeah. You get my point. Oh, shit. More rippers. How the hell did they survive? Oh, they didn't. They just don't know it yet. Deke! Our left! Our left! Yeah, yeah, I got this. What? What's going on? Is he down there? Oh, yeah, that's a breaker. that one of those uh oh that's one of those big bastards oh come on you sons of bitches come on is there one or two of them Over 
Here, you son of a bitch! Don't call him over here. that frickin' Exactly, is that guy? Hulk smash. something out of this.
there's still more of them over there. Stopping off. Before we go in. Gotta pull back. Oh, that guy could take... Come on. That's the last of them. You ready to find Jesse? Oh, yeah. It's time to finish what we started. Have these guys seem more jacked up than usual? Oh, yeah. They must have snorted up the rest of whatever the hell drug they take. Before I go in there, <laughs> see if I can find any hidden gems here. Got it. Oh, I'm back at their compound before those golf clubs and all that stuff was. Come on, you damn rippers. All right, let's go and get uh, Carlos, a.k.a. Jesse. There's no way you're getting up there. <laughs> Joe. Damn it. Here. No. I'll boost you up. Okay, listen. Something happens to me, there's a trail not far from here. No, 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 listen, that is not Carlos up there, okay? Not this founder, rest in peace. It's fucking Jesse Williamson. Fucking low-life piece of shit scumbag who got what was coming to him. All right. Now you fucking go up there and kill that son of a bitch. Hope he's not like that big dude in the swamp. <laughs> Jesse Williamson brought you home. Oh, do you remember back in the day? You and Boozer held me down while Jack burned the flesh from my back. Those, those memories kept me from.
Jacob Saint Charles. Hello, hello, Jessica. Do you remember back in the day? You and Boozer held me down. Jack, burn the flesh. He's not dead yet. You hear Boozer in the background? Clear to me now. <laughs> yeah, me too. Oh yeah. Rest in peace, Jesse. It's done. Yeah. It's done. And I couldn't have done it alone. <laughs> It was good being out in this shit again, you know. I gotta say, shoveling shit and you know, pulling weeds. I know maybe it isn't such a bad way to spend the day. Yeah. Wow. Well, Jesse gone. How many do you think are left? People that we knew from before, I mean. No one. Boo, so there's no one left. Shut. Sorry. Uh, yeah. The Duke hey, said, thanks for letting me watch you play again. Out. Hey, man, anytime. I always appreciate you stopping in. It's good to talk to you and hear your take on some of the little tips you can give me. I do appreciate that. I'm going to wait till the dialogue is done here on this this mission and then as soon as I can I'm going to save it and get off for tonight. You're in the UK, aren't you, Dukes? It's got to be what close to 3 3 a.m. for you if you're in the UK. Uh-oh. Like I said, I, I know we haven't talked in a few years. I guess I disfigured with my Elizabeth being there with you and all. It probably wasn't much point in me yammering away at you. Now oh, and then, and with all hell breaking loose, I, I thought maybe you weren't there. Or you just didn't give a shit. Pardon my language. I guess that's why I'm here. Say, I still don't know. I hope you're there. Hope there's some reason for all this shit we're living through. That's all. We'll, we'll talk again some other time. Oh, um, amen. Deke? Uh, <clears throat> yeah, Ricky told me that I could find you here. Oh! Uh, nah, it's just these knees of mine, you know. It's reason I haven't been praying all these years. Yeah, I'm not a, I'm not a church-going type. Even after living through that shit storm in Sherman's camp. But now, after all this, I just thought, hell, I, maybe it, now it's the time. I, uh, I didn't have a choice, Mike. Oh, everybody's got a choice, Deke. Until they're dead. It's either us or them. <laughs> it's always us or them. Always. You know the reason we're going to hell? 
is we can't figure out that us is every goddamn soul that ain't walking around in shit-stained pants trying to eat us! All right, you know what? You may not like it, but the world is what it is. Yeah, it is. Praying ain't gonna change that. Wishing that it was something else ain't gonna make it that way, Mike. Wishing ain't got anything to do with it. We make the world what it is by what we do. All of us. I let him go. You let Schizo go? Schizo. Uh-oh. Ain't no way he was getting a fair trial. You let him go. Told him to ride out, not come back. <sighs> Jesus Christ, Mike, do you have any idea what the fuck you've done? Yeah. I stopped another killing. You know what? I guess I'm good with that. <sighs> he may have stopped a killing for the time being, but how many more people will die because of that situation? And letting him go. Hmm. At least we're still good with Mike, sort of. And a good, you know, I mean, something we can overcome. He didn't kick us out or anything, so that's a plus. All right. Um. So yeah, I am going to find my bike and save it, and I'm going to call it a night. And I appreciate you guys who stopped. Can I in. help you? watched and commented and hung out with me i i have fun with you guys please come back anytime come back every time if you want to you here to buy something buzz i'll fill her up there, good as new. Sure, all right. My husband used to collect tools away. I I'm here if you need me, man. All right, there it is, guys. There's the quick save symbol. I am going to shut it down for the night. I will hope you guys have a great night, and we will see you again soon. I will probably be playing again tomorrow. Don't know what time, but if you see me on and you feel like hanging out, please feel free to join. I will see you then. Take care.